it's Karen with Make a Difference, Make a Living. Thanks so much for being here with me today. I'm really excited about today's content. We're going to talk about client engagement and how do you get it. Well, I guess not only just how do you get it, but what is it? What is client engagement? Client engagement is, it comes from you putting out regular, consistent material and content to your audience, whether that be through social media or your email management system, your newsletter, wherever you are sending out information and the response that you get back from the clients that are reading it. It can be in the form of video, it can be an audio, it can be in the written word, it can just be a post on Facebook or Twitter, something on LinkedIn, wherever you're posting and putting things and getting responses back from the readers, that's client engagement. Now, how does client engagement help you in your business? Oh my goodness, well, we, it helps so much more than what I can tell you about right here in this few minute video. But what it really does is it builds momentum. Because we both know that when people start talking about a topic, it doesn't matter if it's the new, new style of M&Ms that come out, the latest reality TV show, or your business. Whatever it is that is causing a stir, people are talking about it, it starts to create momentum. And it's like a train going down the tracks. And the faster it goes, the more speed it gains and the more power there is behind it. And that is what happens when you provide great quality content to the people following you and they start talking about your business. Now the one thing you wanna make sure that you do when you are putting out your content is always have a call to action at the end. Now if you don't know what a call to action is specifically, I did a whole other training on that. You'll wanna look for that on YouTube. But the call to action, just real quick, is going to ask someone to do something. It's going to ask them to take some type of initiative to do something for you. So for example, on many of my blog posts, I will put at the very end a call to action. And typically I will ask the reader to come to my Facebook page and tell me how that article impacted them. How did that help? What did it do for you? And so I start getting this momentum, right? Because someone's moving from my website to my Facebook page and then maybe they're moving back to my website. So there's synergy going on there. It is very important that you include a call to action on every single piece of content that you send out there. Now, one other key piece of information that you need to know about client engagement and all the content that you're putting out there. I recently heard from um, a gentleman, a market, marketing person at HubSpot, that 70% of their brand new opt-ins, 70% of the people being added to their email list is coming from articles that they wrote more than a month ago. Think about that. So their whole team, as he put it, their whole writing team could totally go on vacation at the exact same time and their opt-ins would probably only drop by 30%. That's the power of your content. And that is the power of good quality content. Because once it gets out there on the internet, it is there forever. And as people start searching and searching and searching for your topic, your niche, your target market, they will find you because you are going to have more and more and more content that is serving them, and that's the name of the game. I hope this information has been helpful to you, and as always, I look forward to being with you next week. Thanks so much and have a great day. Bye.